Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to the next part of the 100 day speed build challenge. I almost never said that right, but I got there, don't worry about it. <laughs> so today I'm bringing you a different kind of build. I say that with like pretty much every video I put up, but I'm trying to make them all as different to each other as I can because when you're doing the 100 day speed build challenge, you've got to be careful that it's not totally repetitive. So today I'm bringing a Halloween slash autumn kind of home. I got the inspiration for this house off Pinterest. So I'll recreate the house. And if you're wondering how it's so autumnal, because you'll have seen in the thumbnail and obviously this video that you're watching now, that it's very, very, very autumnal. And this is because I've got a mod and I'm going to share it with you as well so you can enjoy it because I'm actually thinking about moving my generations family to Windenburg because it's it's autumn. And I like autumn. Autumn's my favourite season. It's literally only September the 8th, but I am ready. I am sold into it. I'm already planning my Halloween costume. Autumn is my favourite, favourite, favourite season. But the mod that I'm using today is by Danny Paradise. And it's just danny-paradise.com. And she has this autumn mod there. It's the autumn in Windenburg. And you can also get um, the outdoors mod as well. So basically what it does is it just replaces the colour of the trees with red and it yeah it does what it says in the tin but it does also change the grass but I opted not to have the grass because I don't know where I'm from the grass stays green so that looks more autumnal to me but there is the option to have the grass and not have the grass so yeah that's the mod leave it in the description bar I hope you like it I hope you like this build originally I was just going to do an autumnal house but then I thought no I'll have a theme for it so the theme for this is obviously it's Halloween not right now, but just imagine it is. <laughs> so it's Halloween and the person who lives in this house is an old woman and she's a bit kooky. She likes different kind of things. How I imagined it is if Bunny, Graveyard Girl, didn't have Dogman and she was single and she was an old woman and lived by herself, this would be her house on Halloween. So all of the outside is very, very Halloween-esque, obviously. Uh, I use a lot of things from spooky stuff so she just goes all out for Halloween this old woman and people kind of avoid her when it's not Halloween because she's a bit odd she's not your norm which is okay it's okay to not be normal but on Halloween she goes all out and hers is one of the favorite places to visit when you go trick-or-treating also I really want trick-or-treating back in the sims 4 but the load screens would it be worth it but anyway yeah so the insides of the house isn't really it's still kind of autumnal i've put some beams and things and the feel of the house and the lighting of the house is still autumnal the living room is very halloweeny and there's a lot of halloweeny stuff on the kitchen cabinets but i just thought because these could be any regular settees tables and things the wallpaper's not that spooky it was but i changed it so it'd be more normal so i'm just pretending that you know she has normal settees and tables and things but then when halloween comes round, she puts these spooky covers on it and that's <laughs> that's my justification in my head to justify why this woman has these things but anyway i'm getting towards the end of the video now so i'm gonna add some pictures in for you soon for you to look at and enjoy i hope you enjoyed this build if you don't know who i am already i am plumella i upload three times a day 21 times a week and yeah that's it for now so thanks for watching if you watched and i'll see you in my next video bye everyone